United States v. Eggers, 1976. On September 24, 1971, Linda Eggers and James Sewell checked into a motel in Washington, D.C. The hotel staff noticed that Sewell was wearing a Bowie knife. Just 15 minutes later, the motel employees heard screaming and broke into the room and found Sewell and Eggers struggling to get the Bowie knife. Sewell had been stabbed several times and died of his wounds. Eggers was charged with murder in the second degree. Eggers claimed self-defense, but the prosecution argued that she was a prostitute who stabbed Sewell in order to steal his money. After Eggers was convicted, she asked for a new trial on the grounds that the government did not disclose that Sewell had a prior criminal record involving a deadly weapon in violation of the Due Process Clause of the Fifth Amendment. The government argued that Eggers never requested Sewell's criminal record during the trial. The case went all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court. In a 7-2 decision, the Supreme Court ruled that Eggers' due process rights under the Fifth Amendment were not violated. The court ruled that a prosecutor is not obligated to disclose information that has not been requested by the defendant unless that information is significantly relevant to a fair trial. Since Sewell's prior convictions had no significant bearing on the case, the prosecutor was not obligated to disclose it unless specifically requested by the defense.